Uh oh, this guy wants to get out. Blessing be upon you, Rook. Have you... Would you like to hear the fragrant word of Azura? It was she who gave us shape and told us the three secrets. She who protected us from the wrath of Ifre and taught us the mysteries of the moons. Why are you in this cage, hm? Ah, yes. Mazdur entered this den of vagrants with the most honorable of intentions. He only wished to share the wisdom of Our Lady of Dusk and Dawn. This is the unfortunate result. Oh, do you need help escaping? That would be most appreciated. This one is sure you'll find the key nearby. Ah, and if you could recover Mazdur's amulet of Azura as well, the bandit's leader, Zareva Sharpclaw, seemed to admire it greatly. It will likely be by her side. Ah, this one will get the key and recover your amulet then, hmm? Azura bless you, brave rook. How'd you end up in this cave in the first place? Mazdur must travel many places to spread the word of his lady. Through divine inspiration, his paws follow the path to where Azura feels he is most needed. Unfortunately, he is not always met with welcome. Why would Azura lead you somewhere that would be so dangerous, hmm? It is true that Mazdur is trapped within this cage, soon to be sold off to vile slavers. But it is also true that you have arrived to save him in this, his hour of desperation. Asura watches over this one always, and so he is never afraid. Oh, you more about yourself then, hmm? Mazdur has dedicated his life to the brilliance of Asura. Every morning he sings her praises. Every night he humbles himself with prayer. His days are spent wandering elsewhere, spreading her fragrant word. Why such dedication? It was the wisdom of Azura that gave the Kashita many forms, each for its own purpose. It was she who gave us the skills to be exceedingly quick, exceedingly clever, and exceedingly beautiful. How could Mazdur the Moonstruck not honor her? Mazda the Moonstruck, you say? This one's title, bequeathed upon him by his family long ago. Asura was born alongside the moons. This is known. Mazdur is moonstruck, stricken by the beauty and power of the moons, connected to his lady through reverence and wisdom. Someone's moonstruck in the head. Agree. Uh, right this way, possibly. If we are planning on raiding Kushi, I'm staying behind. Nearly got my tail chopped off last time. Big bus. Congrats on another level. Yay! <laughs> Over this way for the sky shard. With so many you wars have going the on, key, yes? No one even if you would open the cage operation. then. And that's just the way I like it. Praise Asura for your timely intervention, Rook. Come now, let us speak outside. Uh oh. He brought friends. At least you got credit. You should have gotten credit because I grabbed it, right? Uh, yeah, I did. Good. 
Otherwise, that would have been really freaking annoying. <laughs> All right, time to talk to the Moonstruck. Master is grateful for such a rescue. Were you able to find his amulet as well? Uh, this one recovered your amulet of Azura, yes? Then you have this one's gratitude. And the gratitude of Asura as well, it seems. Just as Mazdor was leaving, mm -hmm. he happened to find something of value. Take it as your well-earned reward. Ah, oh, thank you. And so Mazdor is once again saved by the intervention of Asura. Through your actions, of course. Well, what will you do now? As of late, this one's thoughts turn to green shade. While the Kashid have always welcomed Asura into their hearts, the Wood Elves still look toward her with apathy. Perhaps it is they who most need to hear her fragrant words. Do you think that would really go over well? Hmm? No. Master <laughs> will be met with hostility. Of this he is sure. But Asura will watch over him and lead this one to those who may be willing. In this, he has faith. Just as he has faith in the Lady of Dawn and Dusk herself. Mm. 